Hey, fancy beauties and balls, what's up? Um, I just got off work and I did a uh, little grocery shopping. So, um, I want to show you guys exactly what I'm doing um, with the groceries and why I purchased so many. So, back before the pandemic happened, your girl was supposed to get a, a freezer. She was, I was supposed to get a freezer so that I can stock up my food. Because that's what my mom used to do. She had one of those upright freezers and she kept that sucker packed. So if anything ever happened, we were good. So I wanted to keep that same mindset, right? But my baby girl made fun of me and said, you turning into a grandma. <laughs> so I ended up not getting it, right? Plus, I was like, okay, where am I going to put it in the house that I was in, right? Well, when I got ready for it, of course, they were sold out because everybody and their mom now wanted to have a... Uh, a freezer because when the pandemic happened so they put me on the waiting list I got it through Badcock so they put me on the waiting list I finally got one I thought it was going to be the upright uh, where the door flips up but it's not I actually picked the one that looks like a refrigerator so I call that one the upright if I'm wrong y'all let me know what the proper name is so I already have some things in here so I put some ice cream the boys um, freezer uh, freeze pops I got some uh, hamburger some chicken and y'all already know that I prep my my meat anyway so I have the chicken already bagged up in the Ziploc bags I have some um, meats that's here. What is this? This is uh, ribs. So I got some ribs. Some, um, I don't know what I bought more uh, ground beef for, but I bought that. And then some um, beef stew. So that's what's in there. And then my pack crusts are in there. In the door, I just got some miscellaneous products over here. Some, some cheese, some bacon, um, that's some fish, uh, waffles, what is this? Some sauce, I got some sauce. This ham hock, I have to have ham hock for my greens. Some cookie dough, it's in the door. Cheese, which is extra cheese slices. And then I think this is more ham hot. Yep, hot. I'll get. Uh, I just dropped it, but we gonna still hold on to that. So I just gotta wash it. So today I went grocery shopping, like I said, and then um in here, and you guys, I keep having problems with this thing. I done adjusted the temperature and it still does it. So I'm not sure what's going on with that. But I got some fries in here, some um, ham, some more cheese. This is some green bean, uh, some green peppers, spinach dip, some shrimp. Have to keep those on the at all times. Garlic bread here, and I got garlic bread here. Um, this is some cheese that I use to cook my uh, macaroni and cheese, my baked macaroni and cheese. Some more fries. I think these are gonna go in the bigger freezer. Waffles. I keep these in here because you know for breakfast. Uh, that's. Dinner. This is for um, work. So um, that is in here because that's needed on the daily. 
Y'all please forgive me for that uh, being in there like that. Some more waffles for the boys. And then um, some steak. Some more steak. I only eat steak like once a month. Some more ground beef. Some more steak. This is uh, tilapia. And then some um, baked potato skins. The Thank God It's Friday brand. So that's what that is. And then my Wendy's. Okay. So let's go through here real quick and see what I picked up. Uh, from from the grocery store, so we got some some Sprite. It's my daughter likes Sprite. Pepsi for my she she likes uh, Pepsi too. Um, but y'all, I got that from my mama drinking that Pepsi and some Hawaiian Punch because those times when I know I ain't supposed to have no Pepsi, I can fall back on this. And uh, the boys also indulge. This one right here is really good, you guys. Some uh, Frosted Flakes. I got some DiGiorno Pizza because the boys absolutely loves this. Uh, let me see if I can sit y'all somewhere. I'll free up my hands. All right, so we'll just do it like that. So we got some more, some more chicken. I bought two pack, two things for the wings uh, because again, we stocking up. So I just want to have what we need to have. And I shopped at Food Line. The boys received a um, hundred and fifty dollar. Uh, gift card from uh, Angel Tree. So we use that. Some breakfast sandwiches for when we on the go. I got some hamburger helper for those days that I don't want to cook for the boys and I don't want to eat. Because I do have days like that where I really don't want to eat, but I know the boys need to. Um, these are so good. They're a little pricey. They're um, $7.99, but totally worth it. So it's uh, the Margaritaville Jam and Jerk Shrimp, and they got a kick to it. So if you like a little kick to your food, that's going to give you everything that you need. I also got the boys some uh, chicken nuggets because they love chicken nuggets. And that will cut down on my trips to McDonald's. Onion rings. So on the soda pop, or I, I say pop, but... On the pop, they had a special. It was four for eleven dollars. So I got two Pepsi's and two Sprites. The juices I picked up um, two, four, six, eight, eight different flavors. Have some nice broccoli, fresh broccoli. And I'm going to either eat this steamed or um, I'm going to fix it where I can just eat it um, raw because it's good for you. Beautiful tomatoes, food lion head. I got three cucumbers and their produce is so pretty. It's so, so pretty. So I picked up three cucumbers, some nanas, <laughs> and 
and two boxes of the breakfast. So all I gotta do is just maintain the grocery supply. That way I don't have to worry about, you know, lugging up stuff all the way up on the high rise flow. <laughs> this is um, filet mignon. That was almost $17. Some celery because it's healthy for you. My daughter likes these uh, ramen noodles, so I picked some of those up for her. Some more uh, hamburger helper. Some seasoning for the steak. I was out of it. I love, love, love walnuts. So I picked some of those up. These were, I think they were on sale for $3.99. If I'm not mistaken. And I picked up some Johnson sausages the mouth and the hot I like the hot the boys um, may prefer the mild ones also got this which is some uh, chicken breast so I can make um, smothered chicken breast this is also work food Healthy choice. You know they always got to act nut when I'm on camera. Sorry, y'all. Get to hear that big slam of the door. Some uh, shredded carrots for the salad. Corn on the These are banana, <laughs> some uh, beverages, some alcoholic beverages. So we got Bahama Mama, strawberry daiquiri, margarita, and another strawberry daiquiri. These were um, two for four dollars, something like that. These snacks for the boys. Welch's and the uh, Black Forest uh, Juicy Burst. So pick those up for the boys for snack time. Some raw honey. Um, and this is uh, Mountain Ridge. This was Almost thirteen dollars. Some soup. I love um, clam chowder soup, so I picked that up. This is uh, gonna be work food because the reason I got work food, some more soup, is because they're not cooking. They don't have prepared food for us anymore some spam for my daughter um, because of the pandemic so I used to bring my lunch anyway because the food ain't that great <laughs> ranch dressing for the salad and some A1 sauce so that's it y'all and I spent let me show you what it look like so, there you go. Put that in. All the way over. And then, over here. And those are the other Hawaiian punches down there. So, 
it was 247 I believe and then the gift card was 150 and then I out of pocket had to pay $97 $98 something like that so I think I did pretty good this should go ahead and fill up the top that it should fill that up and then it should fill up the upright so yeah guys I just wanted to because I'm kind of like getting settled in now because things are kind of falling into place as far as you know getting the place together or whatnot it's a couple um, big large pieces of furniture that I'm waiting for to come in and I don't want to do I don't want to do a room tour right now with the way it's it's looking right now which it it don't look bad but I kind of want everything to be in place already so I'm just gonna kind of walk through and if you want to kind of be nosy in the background you can so you can see what's going on back there and the kids are outside I'll take you in my room come into my boudoir come into my boudoir my boudoir you see my boudoir oh yes you see my bathroom I'm not gonna let you see everything not just yet. <laughs> oh, you guys. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get off this video. Because um, I need to sit down. My feet are killing me. Okay. I gotta find, I gotta find a, I gotta find a, um, what do you call the people, child? <laughs> a podiatrist, blah, 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 blah. a pod, pod, oh, podiatrist, podiatrist? I've been saying it all day and now I get on camera and I can't say it. But anywho, um, I got to find a foot doctor <laughs> because my heels, and maybe y'all know, because I think most of you guys might be around my age, um, maybe you've experienced this, but my heels literally, matter of fact, let me sit down, child. Yeah, let me sit at the dining room table so the my heels feel like I'm walking on bricks like stone or something in the morning time when I get out the bed it's the worst time because once I step down and it's both heels it's not just one I could deal with it more than I if it was just one heel or one side it's both sides, okay? And um, my heels hurt so bad in the morning. When I step on the floor, it feels like glass, like I just stepped on glass. And it just, I, I, I can't really explain the, um, the level of pain that I'm in. Um, so my heels hurt, my knees hurt. Like, let me show you. And to me, it looks swole in this area. And if it's ashy, I'm sorry, y'all. But let me show you. See, right in this area, right right here especially this one this one for me to just do like that 
it's super tender and it hurts really bad but if I show you let me see if I show you looking down see how it looks swole right there see that this one like cuz it don't it is never protruded out like that do you, do you can you see that where it's like a divot right there well that's where it hurt the most and like for me to like bend down to um into a squat position <laughs> no 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 that it hurts so bad um so I need to the doctor already took um blood so I haven't got those results back yet. Uh, and like, like to stretch my foot out like this hurts really bad. So I got to find a uh, podiatrist. Woohoo, I said it. <laughs> um, I got to find a podiatrist and find out what's wrong with my feet. Because when I stand up, it feel like my feet are on fire, literally. And it, it's just a constant throbbing like that. Just boom, 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 boom. So I got to do that. I got to take care of that. Um, first and foremost, because I need my feet to be good. Because... If y'all saw me, I walk really fast, and I need to be able to continue to walk my regular speed. So, uh, yeah, I got to get that fixed. Anytime I run to the doctor, it's bad, because I'm never one to go to the doctor for nothing. Child, I put my health on the back burner, and I know that's not good, but... If I'm not sick like that, I don't go to the doctor. I will work through it. I've worked through having the flu. I've worked through everything. Uh, so yeah, I will tell you these last, these last two to three years, health-wise have been hell on me. Let me tell you. All right, y'all. But let me get off of here because I, I end up sitting on here talking to y'all about nothing. Uh, oh, yeah. We, we are 23 minutes into this here video. Let me get off of here because I got to put these groceries away. It is, um, I think it's after 4 o'clock right now, and I need to uh, take a bath, take a shower, actually, because um, I haven't gotten into the garden tub yet. I'm, I'm waiting on uh, when I really get everything situated in now, and then I can enjoy it. Uh, I, I take y'all with me on that too. But let me get off of here because I got to take a bath, lay down, and um, try to get on the struggle bus so I can finish my um, work week out. I was in so much pain today. I, I literally wanted to cry. I was in that much pain. All right, y'all. Let me get off of here. Because I got to I gotta do that. I really do. I'm just thinking. Just thinking. I'm trying to think what I could take um, so I can get through this last day. It was hurting so bad, I contemplated putting cotton in my... 
putting cotton in my shoes where the heel part is. <laughs> Just so I can have that cushion. It, it literally hurts that bad, y'all. I'm not joking. And I don't want to call off because I'm called off because I got sick. They sent me home. I don't want to call off no more, man. All right, y'all. I'm going to see y'all in the next video because I ain't doing nothing but sitting up here thinking um, out loud. Basically. I love y'all. I'm going to stay loving on y'all. Y'all stay with me. Stay positive. Stay prayed up. Because we still in the midst of. <laughs> we still in the midst of, honey. Um, but I do. I love y'all so much. Um, I'm going to do another giveaway here shortly. I've had some ideas running through my head. Um, it's either going to be cash or it's going to be hair bundles. So stay tuned so you can find out which one I decided to go with and how you can go about winning. Okay? So until next time, I will see you guys soon. Stay sweet. Stay fancy. Because I am. <laughs> Bye, y'all. <laughs> All right, guys, I know I said I was gone for the day, but I got everything organized. I put all the um, groceries away, so I'm going to let you see how I organized it. That's still the same. That's still the same. But we got all the chicken right here. Uh, we got beef down here, french fries onion rings the um pie crust and then over here i just lined up the sausage biscuits or those are actually the mcmuffins my daiquiris ah crap i'm sorry y'all ain't mean to scream in your ear but i bent down and i forgot i was in pain <laughs> um i'll probably edit that out um, cause I don't want to hurt your ears. But my daiquiris are down here. Oh, and then I left the ham hocks. I put the garlic bread. This is still, I kind of tried to put like breakfast kind of sort of things together. Bagged up things, you know, that's the, like this chicken and the shrimp and the corn. I tried to keep it all together and while I'm in here I'll let you look at the laundry room I'm not done because I got to organize all this stuff up here but I did go through and redo the shelving because it was not the business because y'all remember I had them canned goods all up and through here and that it was just an eyesore when you walked in. So at least now it's not so hurtful to the eyeballs. And you can kind of see what's going on in here. So I'm going to go through and label what's in these. Um, I believe it's noodle type foods in there. And here it's... Um, canned goods like vegetables and things like that beans this one is like all the raviolis and spaghetti rings and things like that for the boys some of that stuff need to be given away that's um peaches uh fruit cocktail and things like that this is like spaghetti sauce uh, soups are all in there water I put the sodas over there that's just my air fryer this that's in that bag right there that is a deep fryer for, for a turkey um, tissue tissue micro, microfiber towels 
paper towels the juices 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 water cups uh, Ziploc bags are inside of there and then some cereal here um, that is a container for cereal as well it's low noodles for lasagna rice uh, croutons oh crackers for the chili tea bags macaroni noodles flour sugar my food sealer that I need to unbox it was a gift um, we got the snack foods here some syrup to go some more soup I didn't have any more room onions that is pancake mix over there right there that that's um, some houses uh, and things that the kids will do with mom more cooking stuff my my peanut butter is back there um, so that's everything in the laundry room so over here in the free freezer top part this is what I did to it um, still have that in there I put the sausages in there that is the top uh, tilapia my work food is here some more sausage meats pizza and then over here it's just you know cheese um, ham fries waffles and some garlic bread so I like it like this it's not overcrowded and just to give you a gander down here in the fridge it's not too much going on down here that's the chicken I'm getting ready to cook um, but yeah so that's what we looking like guys uh, uh, like I said I'm getting ready to cook that chicken and I just told my my nephew that <laughs> I was getting ready to cook some chicken. I said, why do black folks always cook chicken their first meal in the house? He just laughed at me. <laughs> so yeah, I'm getting ready to do that. So that's the only reason I came back in here so I could show y'all how it turned out as far as the... Um, putting up the groceries so yeah but that got my nephew right over there guys he got a YouTube channel too so I'm gonna remember to get his YouTube name and put it in the description bar below so y'all can check him out also while I'm on here I got some big big news my daughter has dropped her first single okay and this it's a wrap and it it's a little explicit uh hopefully i can find the clean version so y'all can check it out she's on itunes her song is already playing on the radio online she's she had her first show last night and she did really really good so I'm gonna try to put some of those clips in there um, I just got to get permission uh, from her saying that I could use her music in my video so I'm gonna put the link for that down in the description bar too so you guys can check her out see what she's working with and hopefully you go ahead and uh, purchase her single because it'll, it'll really kind of put her out there like that so but yeah guys that's about it um, I'm almost done with everything like I said the office is mm, 
90% done. I got to get a, a area rug and the curtains because the curtains is just going to set it off in here. It's going to put it in the right state of mind for when I come in. And then I got to put the TV. The TV is coming Tuesday. So I'm going to have to switch the TVs around and um, bring the TV that's in my room in here and put it on the wall over here. So other than that, let me get off of here um, and cook this uh, food that I don't feel like standing over no stove because my feet hurt. But boys got to eat. And I finally got my kitchen together. It found, oops, y'all aren't supposed to see that. <laughs> um, so I, I'm going to blur that out, y'all. ain't going to see that. Um, so yeah, I finally got the kitchen the way I want it sort of kind of situated. Okay. But, um. Dang, I did it again. But the um, the cabinets are uh, organized. And if y'all are any kind of cook, y'all can relate to the fact that you cannot cook in your kitchen unless things are um, in a comfortable, workable situation. You know what I mean? All right, y'all. I'm out. Wow. Mm -hmm. I did. I did.